things like this. So you don't have to just hide from Zijuani. You have to hide from all of Cloud9 if yeah. you don't want to get fought. And, of course, Cloud9 can't do any champion trades after 20 seconds. Another Jeez. fight on Kiwi Kid. This could be the kill pressure. Flash engage comes in. Ignite as well. Kiwi Kid will drop. The stun will trade support for AD Carry. They will drop down. A Zingy's gank finally does pay out. It would definitely be good in the lane matchup if he does that. Oh, Shifter gets, shift gets the charm, gets the dash on in, and that will be the solo kill. No! Oh. Poor JJ steals it, and the trade back. Shifter got stunned under turret. Really daring them to come in, trying to engage on Ken and Lissandra Sijuani. They're hard, gonna ball they balls. up. He goes down first. High re-engages one for one. Core JJ drops. A Zingy will follow. High pops the Zonias. Sneaky to clean up. No ulti. Charm and Amidios, two for one in. Imagine a fight where that doesn't happen. Do, do they overstay, Careful, though? Yep. Gansu hadn't shown oh. up for the first fight. He was full health, full mana, had an ultimate. Expects five minutes, I assume. Yeah. Flash engage. They're going to find oh, High. Boy. Nice charm. High's got basically nowhere to go. Pop Zonia's, but is he really going to live? No. The answer is no. Shifter gets the kill. Assist for Core JJ. And now. And down Lissandra again. And top lane's going to be a target as well. So, balls. That's going to be Hazonia's from the ulti. There's still a minion wave right above them. Flash the way. Can he really live? I don't know why he really burned Flash in this one. Well, he's trying to distract as much time as possible for the front yeah. line. Next drinker, TM at the build for Gamsu. Looks like he wants Ma of Momorty as well. Core JJ flashing in. No Hazonia's ult doesn't come off in time by Balls. Not a good week. Five games in a row. Balls showing so much success on knockout. There's the flash Two initiation. The elimination gonna blow up first. High, can he try to re-engage? Well, Balls will drop two for zero. Meteos forced out, Whoa. but High explodes the back line. Two for two. Now what's gonna happen? Well, Shifter's gonna happen. He's gonna find one. He's gonna run away from Sneaky. A Zingy forced out. Be careful, Graves has crit. Red buff on Meteos has flash. And rank Chase three Q. I the think he's gonna reward, yeah. But when will he get him? Well, keep in mind though, Dragon's gonna be soloed right oh. now by Sneaky, no one's gonna stop him. I don't know if he cares. The ulti gets out! A Zingy! Back into his own side of the map. Lower and lower. Dignitas waiting till they have the AD carry to start it. Meteos pops the lock and shield. Keep it, get three man stun. Shoot the in. They catch balls. It's the fight starting up, but it's two kills. Cloud9. Gamsu forced away. C9 looked pretty powerful, and the chase comes in sneaky and high. One mark from the stun, they get it, down goes Gamsu. No ulti available now. So, 2v4 on Baron. Whoa. C9. He goes, this is tense. Sneaky can't be stopped till Black Shield ends. And then they can turn on him. They can turn the stun lane. Stun. Summoner heal, ignite, burst damage. In comes Meteos. Sneaky versus Kiwi Kid jumps over the wall. Ignite will not kill him, but High takes down Core JJ. Again, High jumps in from the Brand backside. Low. Kiwi Kid can't do much. Meteos is too big. Nice. High Dude. seven, three, and three. Azingi is around if he wants to stun. Goes Whoa. for it. Doesn't get it. Baron goes cloud nine. One for zero. And five armor. But not all the health in the world. Yeah. Ooh, he Last dashed Shepard. away. Medios gets stunned, but that's the only target. There's the hard engage onto the turret, just like old times. Cloud nine, dive in. One kills, two kills, three kills, four. Core JJ not gonna make it a fifth. He's gonna hide away. Three inhibitors down. Minions coming in now. This will be the next. Yep. Is Cloud9 coming back, taking a win. Their eyes are on first place. They took Dignitas down today to maybe get there. Looked a little rocky in there in the mid game, but Cloud9. Oh man. They sure powered up. You can see it by the end of that game. 45 minutes, one of the longer games for Cloud9, but a victory all the same. Victory all the same, and you know, Dignitas, to their credit, made them work for it. 11 kills for Dignitas.